Why not Arizona? You know, think about what you just saw. A company that really got going seven years ago was the top performing IPO of 2013. And it was from Arizona. Think about what you saw this morning when innovators who have literally shaped the face of personalized or precision medicine and collaborative organizations that are bringing together the top drug companies in the entire world to Tucson, Arizona to build solutions. You saw the pacemaker that's smaller than your vitamin pill. Think about that. It's happening in Arizona. Quite frankly, we don't have enough John Kapoor's in Arizona that have the vision, but more importantly, are willing to put their money where their mouth is. It's easy to talk about it. It's hard to do it. You've heard me talk a couple of times today about what's coming in September. And I need your help, every single one of you. Because for the first time, we have the ability to showcase what's going on in this state to people from outside of this state. We have the ability to put on a white hat and reach out and bring in people who wouldn't necessarily know about our industry that live in our state, that are investing right now in other industries, and don't realize the amazing things that are happening here. And it's our opportunity to tell them, to show them, to engage them. It is also our responsibility to future generations of Arizona that we get this job done. Because today, we have universities that are putting out young people with amazing talent. And every time I hear from one of those students that have been at the expo, who send me a note and say, you know, Ms. Kerber Walker, now they are, they, okay, they, that makes my hair go grayer, right there. But, you know, I found a great job in Michigan or Massachusetts or California, and I'm happy for that student, but I'm furious that they didn't find a great job here. And it is our opportunity, all of us in this room, it is our obligation to build this industry so that the research that's being done in Arizona universities gets commercialized in Arizona that the talent that's being developed in Arizona universities gets employed in Arizona. And that the cost savings and the clinical trials and the jobs are right here in Arizona. So I hope that y'all will put on a white hat with me. That you will reach out to companies that you know across our community and across the region and tell them, hey, go check out whitehatinvestors.com. Register your company. You know, even if you don't think you're quite ready for the VCs yet, I've got investors on the selection committee. So every person that applies is at least going to get looked at once. You may not otherwise get that chance. But equally important, tell every investor you know whether they live in the hills or out at the beach. Come see what's going on in Arizona because things are going to start growing rapidly, just like insisted. Ladies and gentlemen, I am the last thing between you and the bar. Catherine and the girls will show you how to get there. 
Yeehaw. Thank you very much.